Okay, everybody, we're going to do something a little different today. We're going to do a vlogging chatting video again. And we're going to talk about one of my favorite YouTube couples, probably one of the most popular of my favorite YouTube channels. Um, and I'm sure some people will probably argue with you that I don't like these people, but on the contrary, I am one of JD Vlogs fans, so I do have a right to talk about them in this video and show this fan art. So, I've been watching JD Vlogs since November 2019. This month, it will have been three years ago since I started watching their videos. A D Fishman is the is the YouTuber who got me interested in them, believe it or not. They're a very lovely couple. And more importantly than that, uh, not only have I been watching them for exactly three years this month, but sometime near the end of this month, I don't remember the exact date, but very close to the end of November, uh, it will have been three years ago since they were engaged. Mm -hmm. Josh and Katie uh, were engaged. Josh proposed to Katie at the Delta Center in very late November 2019. I'm sure a lot of you probably remember that. And they've been married since March 2021. So they have a second wedding anniversary coming in March 2023. But this month is their three-year anniversary of the engagement. Sorry. And I wanted to talk a little bit about this because some people don't think I am part of the JD fam. But of course, we're about to prove them wrong. So, um... Shortly after I started watching JD Vlogs in November 2019, that was a long time ago, I uh, did something I don't normally do. I commented, I commented on one of their videos and asked Josh and Katie and their fans if, that, if anyone was down for me doing their fan art. I didn't want to just jump, go, go right ahead and do their fan art without anyone saying. However, mentally in the back of my mind, I was like, eh, screw it, I'll do their fan art. They act like celebrities anyway. They're very popular, pretty much household names, so it eh, probably won't hurt. And besides, anyway, I, if I'm remembering right, I think the comment in question did get a few upvotes. So there are at least a few JD fam, uh, JD fans back in 2019 who were down. And of course, as a lot of you probably already know, I am a huge fan of Katie Betsine's sister, Biz Betsine. She's one of my absolute favorite YouTubers. And there's one thing that Biz Betsine frequently does that... Um, Josh and Katie don't very often do, and that is reply to and love mark people's comments. Now, I'm not hating on Josh and Katie. I mean, I'm sure I'm sure some of their fans will find some way to misconstrue this and make me out as a bad guy, but hear me out. Uh, Josh and Katie don't respond to everybody all the time, only because they're very busy and they have way too many subscribers to respond to. And I understand that. Um, I've learned to be more patient in the past couple of years and just come to accept that by default, uh, they may be okay with the fan art being up. I still kind of quietly hope that they will see the fan art someday. But mentally in the back of my mind, I know they are probably okay with fan art. Fan art isn't wrong as long as uh, as long as uh, you keep it YouTube appropriate for one thing, and you don't cross certain boundaries. Um, unfortunately, for reasons unknown, they do have a lot of fans who are on the anti-cartoonist agenda that 
for whatever reason, don't want Josh and Katie to ever see my fan art of them. I never have understood why. I guess it's just uh, the old-fashioned hand-drawn cartoon uh, trend just dying down and nobody's interested. And I don't know. Or maybe it's my art style. It's kind of hard to tell. There's a lot of people who are just not into cartoons these days. But Josh and Katie's fans are just... They, literally every time they... Uh, they just don't want Josh and Katie to see this fan art. And it's kind of important that Josh and Katie do see the fan art eventually because even though I've come to accept that by default they, they are okay with the fan art being up, there is a vague possibility and concern that they don't want some of this up. And I would be glad to remove it, but... I just absolutely cannot do that unless Josh and Katie, not their fans, but Josh and Katie, say otherwise. Same with Biz Betsing about the Biz Betsing fan art. And as far as I know, Biz Betsing is absolutely okay with all the fan art I've done of her. Funny story, um... Katie Betsing has actually talked to me before. She did reply to a comment I left on one of her videos once. But unfortunately, uh, it was a comment that had nothing to do with the fan art. So I don't know whether or not she's even aware that I did fan art of her and Josh. And of course, as I've mentioned time and time again throughout this video, her and Josh's fans are just... Shh. Trying to, sh trying to snuff me out. Um, I would highly recommend to Katie and all the other popular YouTubers I've done fan art of uh, is to, when you're not busy, find the time to, because I do make sure to tag everybody, uh, Everybody on YouTube that I've done fan art of, especially now YouTube's making the handles more mandatory now, uh, and the tags and everything, I would highly recommend that Josh and Katie do eventually see my fan art of them. And if they don't like the fan art, that's fine. They can tell me. They can let me know so I'll re remove or privatize it. But I just wanted to do this video because a lot of pe a lot of their fans don't think I'm a true JD fan for some reason. And that's all I gotta say about this video. Thanks for watching. Happy anniversary to JD Vlogs. I'll see you another time.